So we've just come over the ridge descending down towards Sugarloaf near Dunsborough in the southwest of WA. The beautiful Indian Ocean. Just see Sugarloaf peaking up there. So a night of Astro. And we're hoping that we might score a nice sunset as well. Hi guys, how good is this? So this is uh, Sugarloaf Rock, a location that's uh, pretty well known to most uh, West Australians and it's a very popular location for astrophotographers at this time of the year. So we've got the, the Milky Way will be setting down here into the west and it'll be laying flat. So we will get a beautiful Milky Way arch um, laying just above the top of uh, Sugarloaf Rock. Um, yeah, so what more can you say about this location, to be honest? Um, so I'm here with Virat Shah and we'll be uh, doing, we'll be scouting a few more locations, but uh, or at the moment we're just praying that the, um, this cloud clears. It's forecast to clear by about 11 p.m., which will actually be perfect timing um, because that is when the Milky Way will be in about the right position for us, anywhere between uh, about 11 and probably 3 a.m., I guess. Um, and then not long after that, uh, the moon will rise. So we'll be pretty much done by then. And the Milky Way sets, the core itself sets about 4 a.m. So we need to be all pretty well all done by, the, by 3 a.m. So anyway, looking forward to an exciting night here and uh, we'll go and do a little bit more exploring.
Well, hopefully you guys can see some of that uh, colour that's still lingering in the sky. We just witnessed a absolutely stunning sunset over Sugarloaf. Um, so, yeah, I've got a few pictures of that, which I'm hopefully going to be able to share with you. Um, we've had a bit of fun um, scouting. Uh, we saw some whales off in the distance. Uh, Barat sent the drone up and I got, got some shots of them from above. Um, I may have got a couple of shots on the, t the telephoto. Um, hard to say, but we'll have a look when we get back to town. Um, so this is one of the uh, compositions that we'll come back to tonight. Again, we've got the Milky Way just setting through this region here. Um, clouds do look like they're starting to break up on the horizon, which is a promising sign. So with any luck, the forecast is correct and we'll uh, have some clear skies around 11ish tonight when we want to start shooting. So yeah, in the meantime, I'm just going to lap up what's left of this sunset. Cheers, Brad. Cheers for a big day and night. To the world's best chai maker, which is what we need at uh, three o'clock in the morning. Um, okay, what what a day. What a day, 12 hours of shooting. 12 hours of shooting, <sighs> three hours of driving down here, scouting, amazing sunset. Some whales on the way as well. So we got yep. some whales and maybe some dolphins, who knows? Yeah, Barat got some amazing footage on the on the drone, some whales, oh. some uh, great great landscapes, a few selfies, um, and then tonight some really good uh, astro. Um, bit of a few Perseids meteors. Um, not sure if we captured any of those, although Barat got at least one that we know uh, of. One I know, yep. Um, yeah. Anyway, this is going to be short and sweet because we've got to be uh, back home by six in the morning. So Verat can relieve on parental duties. Um, so cheers, mate. Cheers and a good day. Great night and uh, safe drive home. And uh, you'll see the uh, pictures after this. Okay, guys. See ya.